Welcome back, everybody. It is lunchtime, and in honor of that, we are highlighting a fun challenge going on right now that local restaurants are taking part in. It's called the Huntsville Vegan Chef Challenge, and our next guest, Yuri Mitskevich, is telling us all about it. Yuri, thank you so much for coming to the show. We are so excited to chat about this. This is a challenge that is going on all month long. Tell me how this is working. How are restaurants teaming up? Yeah, great. We signed up a, a great collection of local restaurants in town here. I, I'm, I'm really excited about it. It's, it's kind of worked out perfectly where we have like a selection of almost every type of cuisine here locally, wow. which are taking part in the event featuring new vegan uh, foods this month. So it's a, there's a great selection, like so much to pick from for uh, you know locals that want to go out and try some good vegan food. All right, and so kind of tell me too. I mean, this this is a challenge, right? It's kind of a competition of sorts. What's the break? Are we voting in all of this? What does that look like? That's how the event works. Okay. Right, right. So um, all month long, diners can go try the food. There's a special menus each location has. So there's new food that even if you are familiar with the restaurant, you wouldn't, you know, it's, it would be new to you also. Oh. So some exciting new things to try. You go and you have the food, and then. Um, you get the vote so like that's the competition part it's fun you know it's a uh, it's good promotion for the businesses but it is a challenge yeah so the, the diners are the ones who actually uh you know vote on the dishes they have they can um you know we, we have different categories like uh, a lot of restaurant challenges appetizers okay. lunch dinner desserts and they, they can they go the locations are competing for all those so okay and is this an online voting process or can we do it there at the restaurant uh both 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 okay. right right so um our website the veganchefchallenge.org uh, forward slash huntsville has the voting uh, button right on there okay but when you go to the restaurant a lot of them have these uh table tents that um you you can just scan the, the qr with, with your smartphone oh, right takes you right to the form Wonderful. so either way either way and we're seeing too you're i mean again this is actually a, a national competition tell me why uh, this is something that you wanted to bring to Huntsville. You say Huntsville too, they, they got some good vegan food, interestingly enough. Yeah, it, it, the last few years especially, I, I've been really excited to see that. I, I've been coming to town with our, working with our nonprofit for um, for a number of years, uh, okay. doing uh, events at the local universities. Um, but to see like what's been happening recently with the new restaurants, the pop-ups that are featuring vegan food, and um, how much more Common is getting uh, nationally, uh, like restaurants having vegan options now is almost up to 50%. Wow. So it's really catching on. And um, for some, you know, you really see it here in Huntsville too. So that's kind of an exciting thing that we uh, are featuring with yeah. bringing this here is to show everybody locally, some maybe that aren't vegan, but have been like wanting to try vegan food and uh, see what it's all about. Yeah, kind of with, I mean, 50%, any, any insight on that? I mean, why are people kind of gravitating? And we know that is the case, but why are people gravitating more Towards this vegan lifestyle, it, the awareness has gotten so much out there recently. You know, like there's all these multitude of uh, Netflix movies or you know different okay. documentaries That'll that are coming it, yeah. out, and it's becoming more common that uh, people have vegans in their family now or like a friend at work. It's just getting more and more uh, you know predominant that way. So okay. it's making people more curious, wanting to try it out, hearing the health benefits and everything. So it's just coming from a lot of different directions. You know, yeah. For a lot of younger people, do it for the environment. Like a lot of the students here. The local universities mm -hmm. you you'll hear that from them so it, there's a lot of reasons it's just you know at every uh age demographic we're seeing it grow and grow it's really great really great to see yeah well certainly grateful we have so many more options now to adopt that vegan lifestyle you're thank you so much for what you do and you know we're really excited about this challenge recap for us if you will one more time how viewers can learn more about this get involved the competition going on all month long yeah definitely like i said it's our uh, huntsville vegan chef challenge it's on the website if you search it on google you'll find our facebook and our instagram it's got a list of the restaurants right there just just in time for Mother's Day too you can uh, take your mom out for a vegan meal this weekend at one Perfect. of the local spots all right we'll have that link on tvliving.com as well Yuri thank you again so much we appreciate it have fun this month thanks thank you we are back after